Do I understand this correctly? It turns out that a conviction becomes a value and blocks the implementation of a true goal. Absolutely correct. You are seeing ahead of yourself, dear colleague Sudonin. This is very true. A conviction in your consciousness is the one that is afraid of being disturbed. It says, fine, change your worldview. That's okay. Change your emotional status. You may wish slightly more actively or passively, either way you want it, but leave me alone. Because if you touch this cornerstone, everything will fall apart, including the boundaries of reality, the ones that I've built for you, as well as the event-based field, the one that I am creating. You're asking for a bigger event-based field from me? But I'm not capable. It whispers to you. I can't. Just don't tell anyone. But if you touch this conviction of mine, the event-based field would fall apart and you would move to a different egregorial system, the one that is capable of delivering what you need. But I won't survive without you. Yes, I may not be capable of much, but you better stick to not desiring anything new. Better say, I am needed where I'm born. We've never been rich and there's no use in starting now. Let it all remain as it were. And that will mean that you agree with me. I am not able to give you a bigger event-based field, but then again, if I can't, you won't be desiring it either. See how well we reach the consensus. This is how conviction keeps us within the same sequence of events.